Thank you all for the warm welcome. It is wonderful to be home in Thailand. Particularly so on a day like today as we extend a vital section of roadway that connects uh, Fijian to the rest of the nation. The new Anjek Road branches off from Nesongova Road and cuts through 1.8 kilometers of swampland to reach the people and the village of Anjeki. This roadway has been requested by your community after years of facing the hardship of hiring a boat to reach the nearest roadway and make your journey to Nusari town. I know this because you told me personally about your challenges back in 2017 when you first requested that this road be built. Traveling by boat is unreliable. Your ability to go anywhere depends entirely on the swells. If the waves are too big or the wind blows too hard, you are stuck at the jetty. That is a serious issue, especially when you have fresh produce to sell or classes to attend. Fiji is home to hundreds of coastal communities, so these challenges are not new to us. But that does not mean we accept the limits of our geography. Roadway by roadway, bridge by bridge, we are connecting Fijians to a reliable, nationally connected transportation network. Today, that journey has come to Antioquia, and we are proud to deliver this new road and the new opportunities it will bring for each of you and your families. In total, we've spent $3.5 million to upgrade the existing Nesongabao Road and construct the new Antioquia Access Road. Together, that represents 4.2 kilometers of newly built or upgraded roadway with additional of one low-level crossing. This roadway has been open to the public for just over a month, so by now I trust you have seen the benefits of this project firsthand. Farmers can easily access the market in Nosori town quickly enough that the seafood trays stays fresh. You can travel more easily to reach the essential services like healthcare and education. If you need to travel for, uh, for work, that option is open to you. If you need transport materials, that, easier, that is easier than ever. And I'm sure many of you have friends and family who are relieved that you are now on your short drive away. So we will not rest until every Fijian has equal access to the infrastructure, the services and opportunities that make life better and more fulfilling and that give all of our people an equal shot at success. That is the promise I will always try to deliver. Maybe that's why I'm going to say, 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 I'm going to